is guitar business as good as they say it is? We'll find out very soon. Hello there folks, it's Andy here from Andy's World Journeys. I am flying for the first time in my life on Qatar Airways. We are flying to Istanbul with a layover of about, I don't know, eight hours or something in Doha. The first flight is economy, but the second flight is business class. There she is, the A350 Qatar Airways. Well, it's like 5.20 in the morning, we have touched down, we're on time. Wow, there was uh, some spring. I'm at International Airport and the sun is rising. Hello and welcome to part two of this Qatar Airways review. In the last video, I traveled from Cairo to Doha and today it's Doha to Istanbul in business class and we're also going to spend some time at the Al Murjan lounge here at Hamad International Airport. Don't forget to like and subscribe and help the channel grow and let's get down to it. Okay, well. Okay. It's still pretty, it's pretty busy isn't it for uh, 5.30 in the morning. Okay, so we're going to head to this Al Morjan Lounge, which apparently is this way. And um, she said that there was a place to sleep there, so we'll see. We'll see. That doesn't look like fun. So they've got recliners here. But you can just uh, get a get a bit of sleep, a few Z's as they say, or perhaps a few Z's, and that's what I'm going to try and do because I did not sleep through that baby screaming flight. Yeah. A few planes out there. Um, this is just part of the lounge, and um, I've made myself comfortable here and got a few hours sleep, which has been great. And um, over there, there's like a business centre. Yeah, the place is good. Who doesn't love a water feature? And I can't get through this way, can I? This huge area and there is another restaurant at the very end there as well. This place is huge. Wowzers. 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 Thank you very much. Thank you. Yes, sir. Uh, a little bit of pasta. Yeah, a little bit of pasta, a little bit of over here, maybe just a yeah, some veggies as well. Thanks, that'll be. I think that'll be plenty for me. That's great, thank you so much. It's almost like a Sunday roast, eh? How's that for a view while you eat your lunch, eh? Okay, well, folks, the time is about quarter to one. And we board yeah, in about 45 minutes, 40 minutes. Well, I managed to keep that down to one plate. Um, and no dessert. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass on dessert. I, I don't know what I'm gonna get on the flight, um, but it is business class, so I, I presume that I'm gonna get uh, a meal. Yeah, so uh, I guess we're gonna mosey on down to the gate now and leave the, uh, 
the wonderful confines, and I wouldn't say they're confines, this is huge, this place, huge, 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 so big. Leave the lounge and head down to the gate and um, see where we're at. We're just over an hour to go. Don't know how long it's going to take to get to the gate. So far, the Qatar experience has been e excellent. Yeah, you can't fault it, really. Um, the only quibbles would have been at Cairo Airport, and that's not Qatar's fault, that's for sure. Anywho, how many how many business class lunges have I ever actually been in? Like three. Is this the best of the three? Absolutely. Um, wow. The food was really good. The food was really good. And now to the gate, C6, for the flight to Istanbul. About 51 minutes until uh, scheduled departures, so probably definitely want to get to the gate. Hopefully we can get there in 5 to 10. International duty free and a giant bear for you and me. Don't know what that bear's about or why he's got a lamp stuck in his head. Poor Teddy. There's a whole iPhone display there, iPhone 14. And many different Apple products. And if that's not good enough for you, cars galore. My goodness me, what do we got? You can buy a car, you can buy a McLaren, a McLaren duty free. Don't know what the duty is on a McLaren, but uh, it's not a bad car. I said, there's a gate up there, there's a gate up there, there's a gate, there's a gate, there's a gate up there. Boarding is here to, to begin. Sorry, I have to. Update me, huh? Mr. Andrew? Yes. Yeah. Ask it. Yeah, I will go last call and then uh, you update me earlier. Thank you, sir, for Scatteris. Have a good flight. Thank you. They have not started boarding. It's all very confusing. Okay, well, we're all just waiting for the boarding to start, it seems. Is Qatar business as good as they say it is? We'll find out very soon. Just looking at the numbers here. I mean, I don't know what size the plane is, but it's a fairly sparse gate area, isn't it? Thank you. There she is, folks. Separate air bridges. Oh, is it exciting? It actually is, it really is. Hi. Thanks. 18A. Sugar. Hello, I'm Hi. How are you? How are you today? I'm okay, how are you? Yeah, I'm doing great, thank you. <laughs> no worries, thanks. Here we are in the cabin and um, it is super spacious. It's more space than the one in Singapore Airlines. We've got spots here and there. Um, charging point USBs, control of the things you've got shown the door. And of course, I mean you. Mm. Double chocolate tart, fresh strawberries and mango, plain fig and almond tart, artisan bread, pretty, pretty good, and of course, vino. I, th I thought we were going to get a, an A350 today, by the way, but it's a 777-300, um, which is fine. 
Actually, I would say that it's just a little bit older than uh, the A350 that we just took. It's, oh, it's definitely older than the, the A350, and it's just a little worn. Not in a bad way, not in a, not in a something needs to be done sort of way, but yeah. Anyway, we'll be taking off soonish. Okay, well, we're moving on out. And Turkey, here we come. Turkey, yay. sky and uh, there's not a lot to see out there especially as we seem to be turning right right now and uh, flight time is supposed to be about 3 hours 45 and also we have left uh, about 35 40 minutes late we we're waiting for uh, connecting passengers plenty of business class seats free not sure about back there time to as they say relax and enjoy the flight and uh, folks we have uh, 38 minutes until we uh, touch down in uh, the new Istanbul airport folks we are down in Istanbul we're at the new airport not very new it's been operating for a few years now and um, well you can see all the 
Turkish Airlines planes over there and um, crikey Thanks, thanks. Gentlemen, welcome to Istanbul. The local time here is... Oh, folks, it's been a smooth flight. It's been an easy flight. Good food. Great service. Um, very comfortable space. Um, I wish I could fly business class every time. It just makes everything so much easier. Anyway, I'll probably have some final thoughts when I get to my hotel. Thank you. Enjoy. I was there. Okay, folks, well, here we are in the hotel in Istanbul. And um, so a quick summation of Qatar Airways for you. Uh, the, the worst part of it was Cairo Airport, and it wasn't that bad. Um, that lounge was absolutely uh, so needed, and it was fantastic. Uh, and that was the best part of the journey. The, um, the business class flight was, um, yeah, hard to fault really um great food great food in the lounge and great food on the flight um and i did actually manage to get a bit of sleep on the flight as well uh you know i just uh i flattened that bed and uh i got a bit of sleep all in all qatar lived up to uh, my expectations thank you for joining me take care wherever you are in the world may the journey never end <laughs>